I made a fake one. It is day one of Power Month, and I just wanted to take the time out to say, yo, happy Power Month, everybody. Welcome to one of my favorite months of the year. This is where it all started. Power Rangers debuted August 28th of 1993. I was, I, I just turned two at the time. I'm, I've got an August 21st birthday, so directly seven days after my birthday, they dropped a bomb back in 1993 that something that is continuing to go thrive and grow and that is power rangers i'm super excited to talk about this show because i was gonna do this about an hour or two ago and i'm glad i didn't because we got a small release from the power rangers facebook page they were talking about power week and this is what they said hey ranger nation power week is coming in a few weeks august 22nd through the 28th but waiting is rough, right? We're opening pre-orders for Lightning Collection, Mighty Morphin Black, the Atom version, and Galaxy Green. Pre-order now from your favorite fan retailer. Yes, guys, Power Week is coming August 22nd through the 28th. And they gave us a little information about pre-orders, some new figures. We got a, an Atom figure coming, and we got a, a green lost galaxy yo th that's gonna be cool man i'm super excited that we we get an atom figure yo i might have to go get that one real quick um or are you gonna add to your lost galaxy collection Woo! Th this is a good time to be alive and a power rangers fan because this might be the month where we get some really good information we all know that we have 11 episodes left to air on Netflix. We did get episodes 12 and 13 in Spanish via international spoilers, but we still do not have the English versions of those episodes that I really, really, really want to watch. We need to figure out when we are getting those 11 episodes to Netflix. And I believe this is the month. At the end of the month, this has been my prediction for like six, seven months now. Ever since, what, did Power Rangers Season 2, the first part, came out in like March. I want to say it was like March 2nd or March 3rd, something like that. And I predicted from the beginning that we're going to get information in august and we're gonna get the show in possibly september or october now i could be wrong but it's looking like the end of august it would be a great time to give us some information about those last 11 episodes let us get a trailer i believe they did something like this last year with dino fury give us some type of sneak peek into the season it is an exciting time to be a fan and honestly that information is cool and i know we're gonna get dino fury like the second half of this year they they even admitted it in in an investor call what i really want to figure out is will we get some information very soon about our 30th anniversary project that's kind of really what i'm looking forward to now i don't know for sure when we're gonna get it we know it's going to be a new universe they we know they're working on something they i don't know if they ended up signing and casting people that are actually you know signed on however we know that they're they they were in the early stages of casting just a few months ago. We've got a new showrunner to help Jonathan Entwistle on this project. When will we get an official release date? When will we get even a title of what's going on? What will this be called? Will it be called The Power Rangers? Like a lot of people are speculating. I'm excited for that one to tell you the truth because it, it's been a long time coming. We have a lot of fan theories and predictions and we know things are are happening behind the scenes however we have not heard anything about the 
the Dino Fury release or the Jonathan Entwistle project in a good hot minute. At least with the Dino Fury, they did say it's going to happen in the second half of 2022, which could put us in September, October. Could it be a later release? Could we see Power Rangers pop in like November or December? Now, I think that there is going to be um, a longer hiatus for Power Rangers after Dino Fury because they're just starting to shoot this show th this month. It's August 1st, I think in like 20 days, 15, 20 days they are shooting. They're in the early stages. So I don't know how long it's gonna take to get this done and what exactly they are going to do. But I do believe that there should be some type of information coming soon just because once they start filming and get into the suits and the morphing sequences and the monsters and whatever, People are going to have their phones out there. We're going to be able to see it. So you'd think that Hasbro would at least give us an idea of what's going on. Correct. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Speaking of the comments, let's get into the comments and see what the fans are thinking. Byron says, hopefully in August, we get some news on the second half of Power Rangers Dino Fury season two. Will it, and I, I agree, man, because it's it's been a long time coming. We haven't heard anything about Dino Fury in a minute. It was cool to see that they did say something small with the second half of 2022. It's coming, but that still doesn't kind of tell us when that could be, you know, any might could come in December. Um, I hope, I hope it doesn't. I hope it comes earlier than December. Please give it to us in September or October, man, please. Man of the USA, Jones says, I can't wait to hear the news on what we're getting. I agree, man. It's, it's going to be a great time when we do get some news. It's just like a tip of the iceberg with our fan predictions and theories and stuff. There's a bunch of stuff that's coming. I can't really like tell you what, cause I don't know what it is. I, I just sit here and we speculate and we talk about it, but there is a good chance that we are going to get a lot of news within this next, hopefully few months. A, a, at least, you know, I'm safe to say like within the next year, you're going to get a lot of, of news of what's happening. But I, we're, we're sick of like, of speculating we almost it would be really nice if we got some news news this month at the end of the month power week give us some news baby it's power week jonathan collins said i'm excited for the 30th season but honestly i won't be excited until i see the anniversary details from hasbro i'm sorry but hasbro has honestly been really slow and kind of lazy on power rangers this year i want to see new lightning collection figures and dino fury toys but of course th there hasn't been last night they released photos of the lightning collection dragon zord and lightning collection mighty morphin metallic ranger action figure but i wasn't impressed i want to see stuff that i can afford not stuff that i have to spend a fortune on well buddy it's coming i'm telling you that this month if they don't give us a nice amount of stuff give some toys for the fans we did get some new lightning collection pre-orders today if if they don't kind of hit a home run and and give us some information this month then i guess you know what you can criticize them because it has been a slower month uh these last few months have been kind of slow with power rangers i can't lie i won't deny that so this month is what i've been predicting and hoping for that you know we get five to ten toy releases something new we get um some information on dino fury when that's going to come out and then for them to just talk about this new Jonathan Entwistle project would be fire. For them to just tell us, like, give us an idea what's going on. I don't, like, even if it was just a picture with the, the, the logo. Do you remember, like, the 2017 Power Rangers logo? Like, that was one of the first things we saw. There was a small little uh, teaser. Like, there was a, a, a helmet or something they showed. It was cool. 
We don't need to see a teaser trailer. We don't need to see anything. It would just be nice to see a teaser graphic, a teaser poster. Give us something to acknowledge that this is coming and maybe give us a release year. Like, hey, coming in 2024, look out for the Power Rangers and give us a little graphic or something. That's all I'm really asking for. I'm, I'm not looking like at it like, oh, we're going to get a trailer. No, I really doubt. I think there's a 5% chance we get a teaser trailer because they haven't really casted anybody. There's not, yeah, like maybe there could be something of, you know, maybe a Power Ranger doing a move or someone doing something. But honestly, I'm just looking for a graphic. I'm looking for a mini poster, maybe something that that just kind of connects it and has us talking about it. And maybe if they did it like a like like almost how you would do a thumbnail and kind of get people talking, get people clicking. What if they they made a graphic that kind of makes us um, makes us talk like, oh, does that mean that the Green Rangers coming back? Oh, does that mean Draken's coming? Oh, well, what does that mean? what what is this like, like that's what i'm looking for i'm not looking for a trailer like and what do you guys want to see this month from power month i think that this is key i i hope the people from hasbro are watching this because the fans this is your opportunity let me let them know tell us what you guys want to see this month for power month what is going to kind of make it or break it for you? Let us know in the comments. I agree it has been slow the last couple months, but I think that they have something up their sleeve. This month it's going to be cracking and there's going to be a whole power week. There's going to be a week where we get some releases and some drops some pre-orders all that fun stuff hopefully we do like a fan first friday hopefully there's something to look forward to and there is so i'm gonna be positive about this and give them a shot every once in a while there are times even when saban ran the brand there are times when power ranger news was slow man it's just it, it happens sometimes and right now it has been a little slow but hey let's give them a chance let's see what they're doing robert says i'm very much looking forward to what the news will be me too man i would love it anna said i can't wait for this i'm excited i never miss a thing hey shout out you anna big power ranger fan uh the anime diego said is cosmic fury going to be on netflix series like dino fury I believe that this will be a Netflix project, the series, the upcoming 30th anniversary. And yeah, I guess we didn't even talk about that. Are we going to get any news about the 30th anniversary? That's kind of another thing. And then the, the Jonathan Entwistle project, really like, I would love to get some type of news on that. Now, the 30th anniversary, that's a whole other thing that I, I do want to kind of shed some light on to real quick. We know that we are getting a, a 30th anniversary season, and there's talk that there could be a female lead and she could be the daughter of Trini. That is kind of the talk and the rumors right now. We don't know if that's going to be true or not, but a 30th anniversary reunion season would be dope. We also have heard from Austin St. John's live stream that the reunion is real, that they, they reached out to him and he's not doing it, but that is a real thing. He even speculated to JDF is probably involved already. So I'm, I'm excited for that. You've got a 30th anniversary coming. Give us some news on that. What about the Jonathan Entwistle new universe that I just, I feel like I ranted for like 20 minutes about there's a lot going on and i really want to see it olivia said if any of us fans had our way the 30th anniversary would be a season-long version of the once a ranger episode from operation overdrive but actually completely written don't get me wrong i love that team up simply because it's the disney area but i can even face facts so yeah make something like that but make it a little better that would be cool but if you did it with the mighty morphin ooh, on a note that's actually related to the female red ranger she says at the risk of sounding woke i do indeed want a female red ranger full-time but for reasons to contra contrary to what it sounds 
The female Red Ranger would seem the most appropriate if they adapt either of the two uh, speculated Sentai seasons. My understanding of the two motifs is that they're kind of girly stuff here in the West, or at least that's my possibility. Dead wrong understanding. Okay. And, and I agree with that. Um, that would be cool. And I'm for a female Red Ranger. I think it would just be cool. Let's switch it up. Um, on a lesser note, they have yet to do an uh, Adventures in Coma Land season of Power Rangers where five fans become Power Rangers because the Rangerverse is their, is their Coma Land because they're fans. Huh? That's cool. That's fun. I like that. What do you guys think of that fan theory? Dylan said, this news better be good about the series next year. And these last 11 episodes of the second half better be on Netflix by next month or September. Or I'm going to lose it, man. It's coming. Patience is the key. That's what Jab Jab just said. I agree. Let's just all chill. It's going to be a good month. If they don't give us anything this month, anything uh, about the Dino Fury show or the Jonathan Entwistle project or the 30th anniversary, we should get some type of news about the 30th anniversary. I mean, they're filming. They're filming in August, man. So, like, we should get some type of news. Um, Living Water Ministry said, as a reminder for everyone, it's not going to be on Netflix. Netflix is doing really bad. We don't know when they're going to drop the 11 episodes. No. It, one, it's going to be on Netflix. And two, so fans probably don't get this. We just read headlines and we read it and articles make it look bad. And Netflix is still the top dog streaming platform right now. They're just experiencing some difficulties of they're basically streaming as the new world and everyone has a streaming platform. You didn't think that people were going to go to other streaming platforms. Of course they are. Netflix right now though, still has hundreds and hundreds of millions of subscribers. They're, they're definitely still a top dog, but times are getting harder, meaning that they have to do things to bring in people like that. That's basically what it is because you have your Disney pluses. Now you have your HBOs, you have your paramounts. It gets a lot harder for Netflix to, to be the top dog. Now there's, there's a smaller gap than there used to be, but right now Netflix would still be the best streaming platform to put it on. As of right now, it's still the top dog. It has the most subscribers to my knowledge. However, it's getting tougher. Um, definitely there, Disney and HBO Max, Paramount Plus, they're all kind of right behind there. And they're trying to take that number one spot. Netflix has to keep making good content. So definitely they're, they're, all of their Power Rangers stuff is, is going to have to be good. They're going to have to bring us in because uh, there's people that have canceled their, their, their Netflix um, subscription and are waiting for Power Rangers to come back to kind of pay for it again. So it, it's got to be good content. And I believe it is going to be creative world said Yen is going to be our first female lead as a Red Ranger in season 30. Oh man, I'm hoping. And the name Yen could change, but I think it's cool. You have Trini's daughter, bring her back. I would absolutely love this. What are you guys thinking though? Let me know in the comments. I want to thank you guys so much for taking the time out of your day to watch the fan club. You're the real MVPs. We'll talk to you soon. Peace. Shout out to our Gold Ranger member, Jeremy. Sign up to be a member today. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this content, you know what to do. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. You can also become a member. Please join the fan club support team right now. We have a Blue Ranger power up and a Gold Ranger power up. This is an awesome way to talk with the fans. Join a fan club official chat group. You can also be featured in our videos. At the end of the videos, I will shout you out. That's if you get the Gold Ranger power up membership. Go check it out. Go support the fan club. We love you guys. And thanks for watching. Peace.